Hey, happy Wednesday, my loves. How are my aquas this morning? We're going to get started and see what Spirit has uh, for today, Wednesday. Um, and let's, let's get started, guys. I'm also offering that $20 reading for anyone who's interested. Just click on the description below the video. And guys, if you're enjoying the videos, uh, can you please subscribe? It helps the channel quite a bit. And, you know, hit the... Uh, Hit the notification bell. All right, guys, here I'm seeing right off the bat is somebody, uh, this person is a giver, okay? You're very giving. You're very loving. You've been helping someone out, but it looks like you're going through some kind of uh, chaos right now and you're feeling stuck about it, okay? So you've, you, you've been helping somebody financially, but it's putting a lot of stress on you and you're feeling defensive about it now. And you don't know how to get out of this, but it's draining. It's draining you financially. All right. I am seeing some kind of a uh, really cool opportunity coming in for you. Um, that might, let's go further and see. Yeah, I feel like this has something to do with uh, your job, your career. Um, you're waiting for a shoe to drop here or you're just your spidey hairs are up and you're thinking something's up with this emperor who is, you know, uh, a boss figure. Uh, everybody's focusing on him right now. All right. Because they all there, there must be some kind of rumor or something going on regarding the business, the company, your money. You guys are concerned. All right. I'm seeing that. Um, Something spiritual is coming that's going to bring in happiness, okay? This is kind of like <laughs> totally off subject, but I'm seeing spirit here and I'm seeing a lot of happiness. So um, maybe that's going to be the answer, okay? That would be the answer to a lot of problems, wouldn't it, guys, okay? Watching your bank account grow, seeing your money, standing back and seeing your money multiply in the bank, okay? Okay? Here I have a masculine who is working really hard. And here it is, guys. I'm seeing an ending here. Okay, so someone or maybe uh, a few of you have or are going to lose your job. You're just waiting for the shoe to drop. Okay, you might already uh, be hearing rumors or you know about it. Some of you already know about it. I'm sending you love and light, guys. Don't wait. Go out and line up three interviews if this is the case. And while you still have your job, this gives you negotiation. Um, you know, you'll be able to say, I don't know whether I'm leaving my job or not. It depends on what is out here for me, what is being offered. So they're going to understand that they're going to need to offer you more to get you to their company. So you're going to have that leverage while you're still at your job. Okay. So here I'm picking up on some type of celebration coming in for this couple. I have the Empress and the King of Cups. You guys make a beautiful couple, by the way. Very strong together. Very loving, giving. The King of Cups is family oriented. I'm seeing something coming in for you. Something wonderful that is going to have you celebrating. And I'm also seeing a connection here with this Queen of Wands. Okay. So I don't know who she is to you, but... Um, this is someone in your circle who is going to be connected to all this celebration or enjoying it with you. Here I'm seeing abundance. I'm seeing abundance next to this empath. Now this could be a masculine or a feminine. An empath you have like super, you're super powerful. You don't, probably don't know it, okay? But you pick up on people's energy. You... Um, can be in a crowd and just start feeling crappy out of nowhere and just want to be alone and go home and get away and be by yourself. That's because you just picked up on everybody's issues, their problems, their, they, they couldn't make their bills this week. You know, all of those emotions from all of those people can be very overwhelming to an empath. Okay. At the same time, you're a very strong person. You know, you're an empath because people will just approach you and just start spilling their guts and telling you about their problems, their day, 
you know, um, just like as if you were a family member, somebody that they've known their whole lives. It happens to me a lot. Um, uh, if I'm sitting in a doctor's office with my mom or, you know, my daughter, the person next to me will just start talking to me as if they've known me their whole lives and tell me all kinds of personal things. All right. But here I'm seeing there's something that you're wanting for a really long time that's coming in for you. Okay. So Get ready for that, Aquas, okay? Some of you that are empaths that have been dreaming about something or wanting something or trying to manifest something, that something is about to come in for you, all right? And I'm picking up on some, uh, someone's feeling really upset this morning over something that may have ended, okay? But um, I don't know if it's uh, a transition that you're going through, due to an ending this card could have a dual meaning well it could have many meanings but i feel like you're transitioning out of something that was very emotional for you very upsetting and you're finally starting to move uh through it or past it and this is going to be your justice okay because you're almost there and i'm seeing this ace of wands for you doors are going to start opening so in essence, as you're moving through this, you're raising your vibration and therefore you can expect these doors to open wide and things, you know, presenting themselves to you, positivity and things growing for you. Okay. Like this is, these are things that start off like a seed, a seed that you planted and then you see them growing exponentially um, and, you know, standing back and feeling very proud of all these things coming in. And here I'm seeing this two of pentacles at the same time right now i would say you're 50 percent there as far as your transition okay so you need to go the other half of the way all right just put yourself on a pedestal and treat yourself like you're the best thing since sliced bread okay um seeing a partnership here and i'm also seeing um, so somebody's partner took sick. You just found this out recently. Um, yeah, and you're hoping for the best. You're wishing for the best here. You're hoping that things are going to be okay. I am seeing, you know, a lot of chaos going on. Um, yeah, I'm seeing something here that, you know, this is not like a cold, this is something more dramatic, more um, intense, this illness, okay, so you're hoping that, you know, something is going to pop up in the interim while you're, uh, this person's receiving treatment, you're hoping that something uh, is going to come out uh, regarding a cure, a possible cure, or something good coming out of this, and I'm sending you um, love and light, prayers, hugs, okay, I'm seeing also some kind of commitment here, all right, to my aquas, I'm seeing something, again, uh, going on in the background where, you know, there's a financial struggle for a lot of you that is getting ready to end, okay, so something big is coming, you can expect uh, an ending, and then a beginning to something wonderful, okay? So here I'm seeing this windfall, all this positivity for each of you. Each of you are going to see this positivity, all right? We've already gone around the bend, guys. It's time to turn off the tube. It's not helping your psyche. I keep talking about how we're in going, moving back and forth between two timelines. You can see it very clearly. I mean, when you turn that thing on, all you're seeing is the takedown of the, you know, the old, the takedown of the third dimension. Okay. That's what you're watching. The third dimension that we've been living in for many, 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 many years in a suppressed state. Okay. Is going away and we're clearing out the old for the new all right the new there are things going on in the background guys that you know a lot of you are unaware of the new is going to be something spectacular okay it's including a windfall it's including 
a lot of positive things for your betterment coming in for you, okay? These things also include health things, things that are going to in, improve, uh, if not, you know, annihilate bad health, okay? And, you know, abundance, we're seeing the abundance card next to the windfall card and freedom, okay? These are all things right now that we've been struggling with and for things we need, things we want, okay? And they're saying that your struggle is over, all right? So that's telling me that, you know, guys, you know, I woke up wonky this morning, um, just feeling like this uphill battle is getting tiresome. You know, I too am waiting and, and needing and wanting, and it's just, you know, it, it's just getting, it's getting old, okay? But spirit Spirit is saying that we don't have that much further to go, all right? They're saying they know that um, my Aquariuses are feeling ignored and there is something coming, some type of offer that is going to bring in finances. We have the Page of Pentacles in the center, guys. The cards in the center are usually like the pressing part of the layout, okay? Or the most important, most outstanding area in the reading um, per layout, if you know what I'm saying. So they're saying that the offer is coming in and it's financial and it's going to be this great victory for all of my aquas. And truthfully, guys, you, you may not realize this, you're manifesting it. You're, you're manifesting it because you're thinking about it. You're thinking about it a lot. Okay, so here we go, guys. I'm seeing, you know, you're going to soon have a lot of things uh, to choose from. A lot of different opportunities and choices and just choices galore, okay? And for my empaths, they're saying, use your intuition on this because it's coming. Use your intuition Use your empathic uh, feelings about this celebration that we're getting ready for, okay? And over here, I have this Queen of Pentacles. Again, this has to do with finances, but it's also just people, just how they're feeling right now. This is the temperature of my aquas. Just, you know, financially, just, you know, feeling like alone in your plight, like just wanting this to end already. Okay, and I can definitely agree with that. All right, I'm seeing something very spiritual coming in here. Something spiritual about the things that my aquas want coming to fruition. Okay, here I'm seeing a broken heart and, and feeling left out in the cold. And in between, I'm seeing a balancing out, a balancing out. So they're saying, guys, that the balancing of these emotions is coming in for you. You will get what you want finally. Spirit is behind this. They're pushing for this. They're bringing this in. This is this is a blessing from God, from source, this uh, financial blessing that's coming in. All right. I've been trying to stay away from that. You know, I think some people are tired of hearing it um, because it, it, they, they need it so badly. I am on that list, guys. I am sick of, you know, going online and looking at, you know, people giving dates for this. People are out there, you know, saying this is going to happen on Tuesday. This is going to happen on Friday and by next week, blah, blah, blah. You know, I never give dates. Um, I don't go there for a reason. I know what's going on in the background and how intense it is. Okay. Um, there's a lot going on and everything is timing right now. So I hope you enjoyed the reading, guys. I hope uh, if you are, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. It helps the channel and it helps me. And I hope you guys have a fabulous Wednesday.